Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today is Sunday. Um, it is the 17th of March and I have finally have a computer that is back together. Um, so my drive came yesterday, the uh, correct drive that I needed for the laptop. Um, and I managed to get everything up and running this morning. Uh, I say this morning, this afternoon. I've been um, doing that and also tidying my desk and the shelves and just getting rid of a load of clutter and I had lots of bits of pieces of wood that I was keeping because oh I might need that tiny little bit of wood to cut something on um, so I've got rid of a lot of um, just scrap wood um, and other bits and pieces that I just don't want anymore but what I have also done is I had my shelves on the um, so, my, the, sorry, I had my drawers that had my wood in on the shelf and it just looked a bit mm, out of place. So I've managed to put that in my cupboard now um, and tidy a few bits and pieces up. And yeah, so I feel a lot better. Um, fingers crossed the computer just runs like normal. <laughs> um, obviously with anything new there could be like updates or glitches and stuff like that so but I thought I'd come on and start vlogging so here is me back vlogging. Um, I'm gonna vlog for um, hopefully the rest of March we'll see how it goes. I'm so sorry there was such a big gap um, and I as you could see the last video that I did actually uh, film was on my phone um, and it had the uh, Wondershare Filmora thing down in the corner um, I don't know if it was this corner or that corner I can't remember uh, but that is because I tried using iMovie on my phone and it kept saying I didn't have enough storage um, I googled it and a lot of people were saying that it's just something that uh, iMovie does even though you've got enough storage um, so I ended up using Filmora which I use Filmora for my normal editing on the computer but it's a paid for version so I've paid for the license to use it and I pay for the extra to use the um, <sighs> like not just the free parts of the software so there's like um, there's there's like effects, there's transitions, there's stickers and like the the writing and all different ones that you can have paid for as well and that's like a separate subscription um, and I do pay for that as well so that's why I really wanted to get my laptop up and running properly to, to fulfill what I was paying for um, and it's like a lifetime subscription so it's or a lifetime you pay it and you've got it for lifetime so it's not like oh I'll just use it till it runs out and then I'll get something else um, so yeah I've also put my laser um, software back on uh, the computer and that seems to be working okay um, I just need to put my hard drive back in there uh, I've got like um it's in it's it's a big hard drive that, that's in there that you can take out and whatever um so i i'm going to i need to put that back in there and then i need ian to put the back on it <laughs> cuz he took all the screws out and he said let he he will put it back together cuz he knows where everything goes um so yeah i was just doing all the updates and i'm just really pleased that i've got it working um and fingers crossed it will work fine and we'll see how it goes um, also um, because obviously you've not been here for over a week is it over a week I know I did that little that little video but it that was just showing my finished object um, of my jumper but I did finish my hat as well so my hat is finished and this is um, fade from one to the other um, I'll talk about that in in a second but so yeah I am here I'm back vlogging and while I've been away we've had um, we've had weigh-in on Saturday obviously um, and I lost a pound Ian lost a pound um, and niece is going and I'm sure she won't mind me 
um, saying what she's losing because she's on TikTok and she is doing little TikTok videos. Um, she lost three and a half pound and got a stone award, so that is amazing. Um, and our friend, she got her two and a half stone award. Um, so yeah, it was it was really really good. Um, we also got nomina nominated for the two of us, um, so it was like a little um, not competition, but like a little. Uh, thing where you could vote for a couple or two friends or um, stuff like that um, and we got nominated but another lovely couple won uh, the lady has been at Target for a year just over a year and her partner goes and he's nearly at Target as well uh, so yeah they, they, they won but it, it's not going to be announced because um, the lady couldn't make it last week. Um, her husband was there, but um, the woman wasn't there last week, so that's going to be announced. Um, that's going to be announced next week. Um, but we already know who won. If that makes sense, <laughs> she didn't want to give it. Any, she didn't want to give it away. She wanted um, the wife to be there as well. Um, what else has been going on? Um, not a lot really. It's been quite a quiet week to be honest and I think if I had vlogged it would have been very quiet. <laughs> um, yesterday after we went to weigh in, we went to the CAF, uh, I went to B&M, um, I have potted um, a few seeds and I think you see them, I think you see them, you see me pot them but they have started sprouting and they're getting quite big. Um, Ian's sister also gave me six strawberry plants yesterday. Uh, she's got an allotment and um, she had runners, lots of runners. Um, so she's given me six to pot. And I do want to get out in our little garden. And I know it's communal and a lot of people say, oh, you shouldn't really play about with the communal garden and this, that and the other. But if I'm making it better, and I, I'm only going to put stuff in pots so that it can be taken away and stuff. Um, we've got other, we've got bits and pieces out there already. But if we can make it re look really nice and we can grow some veg, um, and the people that obviously use the garden are welcome to pick the veg and stuff. Um, it's just yeah, just to make it nice out there. Um, but yeah, I, other than that, there's not really been much this week going on. Ian's been on nights, so that's been sort of. Like, he's been getting up a little bit later than me and then obviously going to work overnight and stuff. So, yeah, it's just... But this week, he's back on days. Um, he's at work today. His roster is Sunday to Thursday. I get so confused. <laughs> but I think this week he's on days and then next week he's back on nights, I think, because there's overtime and stuff. Anyway, <laughs> yeah, it just it just confuses me and at the beginning of the week I just say what what you work in is <laughs> easier <laughs> um but should we talk about a little bit of knitting uh so this is the muscle bra hat I knit it on a three mil needle um and I think for me it's a little bit big I knit the ad adult large so the next one I'm going to cast on because I am going to be casting on another one I'm going to be doing the adult medium uh, it is really nice and I probably will wear it. Um, I'm going to see if my sister likes this one. Um, I think my sister's got a slightly bigger head than me. Um, that's not being rude or anything, but I think she has just got a, uh, a very slightly bigger head. She's got more hair, like her hair is so thick. Um, so that probably is why she can get away with bigger things. Um, I've still got my little progress keeper here because that's where you see it last on the podcast. Um, I haven't blocked this yet. I think blocking it might make it humongous. <laughs> um, but I might try blocking it lengthways. Um, like, yeah, pulling it out lengthways instead of widthways. Um, I did post a picture of me. Did I post a picture? I can't remember. There was a picture of me um, wearing it. I think it was at the end of that video that I did um, the last video obviously I've got my hair up in a bun so there's a lot of extra there so it can be brimmed um, I haven't weaved in my I have weaved in my ends I haven't cut my ends yet 
So that's the blue side, and then the purple side. There's not as much purple out on this side, and I had the tiniest amount of yarn left over. That's all I had left, minus the hair. Uh, so yeah, that's that's that. Uh, tomorrow I am getting my hair done, so I'm going to run this today's vlog into tomorrow because um, I doubt I'm going to get much filmed tomorrow with me getting my hair done and stuff. So I'm just going to run this into tomorrow, then hopefully get this edited tomorrow night, uh, and it'll all run fine and there'll be no problems. But isn't this hat lovely? <laughs> um, so yeah. I've been trying to drink more water because last week I just I found that in the middle of the night I was waking up, my mouth was so dry. You know like the roof of your mouth? I was just like, I, I don't know, it was really, really bad. So this week I'm going to be filling this up every day and trying to drink at least one. So I've drunk this much already today. Um, it is 10 to 4, but... Um, I probably will fill this up again, to be honest, because I felt very, very thirsty today. I've not felt really hungry. We we had lots to eat yesterday. We had so much food. <laughs> so we went to the cafe in the morning, and then in the afternoon, we I was I really, really wanted McDonald's, and I just had a craving for the chips. I love their chips, um, and so we went to McDonald's, and I got a cheeseburger and some chips and a drink. So not masses amount, but I had that. Then we went to Harvester for dinner last night uh, with Ian's sister and niece. And oh my God, I've never felt so heavy, so full up in my life. <laughs> I, honestly, I don't think I could get anything else in my body. <laughs> I, w I just, I come back and uh, I made a cup of tea and I was like, I was looking at it and I was like, I don't even think this is going to fit. <laughs> oh, I was so, so full up. Um, and then in the night I had to, I, I got up and I, I got this out of the, because like, this was full up in the fridge. I got that out of the fridge um, and I had to have some, some water because I was really, really thirsty. But all day today I haven't felt hungry at all. I've had a hi-fi bar um, and that's it. And like I say, it's nearly four o'clock. But I think I'm so full up from yesterday. <laughs> like, my body could probably do with a break of food. <laughs> um, we're going to get dinner tonight, obviously. Um, my dinner at Harvester was quite healthy, actually. So you have the salad bar um, and we had that. I had breaded mushrooms, which, yeah, not as healthy, but um, for for Maine, we had, or I had, a chicken skewer, um, and it was like chicken pieces with peppers, um, and I had chips, but it's not the most unhealthy thing. Like, I could have got a burger in a bread bun and stuff, but it was really nice. I really, really enjoyed it, um, and then we did get ice cream. We did share it, though. We did share it, and Ian did eat majority of it. Um, if he was here, he would be going, no, I didn't, but he did. <laughs> um, which was fine, because I was so full up. But you know when you just want something sweet? But, um, yeah, we had a really nice day yesterday. Today's just been a really chilled one. I got up, I sorted my wardrobe out. That's all nice and tidy. Um, I had a shower, and I was like, shall I wash my hair? Mm, no, probably not, because I'm getting it done tomorrow anyway, so I was like, oh, I'm sure my friend won't mind my hair being greasy. Um, and then I thought, oh, I'll do the computer, and I've just been pottering around and doing different things, and and now it's four o'clock. Um, I've been knitting on a sock, which is um, my March sock. I'm close to the toe now, um, so this is it. It's in Astral Journey by uh, Mouse Switch Yarns. Sorry, Astral Conflict. It's in Astral Conflict. Um, I also got my nails done on Friday. Um, they really badly needed doing. I think I, they were like four weeks. And I've just gone for this pink. It's like a sparkly pink, but you can't really see it until like 
you're up close. Um, yeah, I just thought I'd go for something a bit plain this time, and I've gone a bit shorter. Um, Ian fitted my new stereo in my car. He told me to stop saying the word stereo because I can't say it properly. <laughs> I was going stereo. He was going, what is it? I was going a stereo. And he was going, no, it's a stereo. I was like, no, it's a stereo. <laughs> um, never mind. Uh, so he fitted that. I'm fingers crossed that he's fixed the leak in my car. So there's like, what? I'm not sure if I've said all this or not because I've also said it on Zoom. So I apologise, but there's wires that come from like the computer of the car that's under the bonnet through into the, like under the windscreen and the little thing, the rubber had gone. Um, so he's um, sealed it all and hopefully, fingers crossed, that will fix that. And the boot, he's, he's, he's done something to the boot as well. And hopefully that fixed the leak in the boot. Um, but yeah, so I needed shorter nails because my um, my, my new stereo <laughs> is touch screen. And I was really struggling with the long nails. Um, so hopefully having them short and then getting used to it, I'll be fine. And I can always use my knuckle. I do that a lot um, when my nails are a bit longer. Use my knuckles for things. Um, you just adapt, I suppose. Right, I've rambled for 16 minutes. <laughs> um it's because I haven't spoken to you for ages. Um, I'm going to sit down and watch some YouTube because there's some videos that have been uploaded. I'm going to knit on my sock. I'm going to try and get the toe done. Or to the toe at least. Um, I've got my Bustleton top, my V-back and my Alpine Bloom to get finished at some point. I did want them finished for um, the end of March. But that ain't going to happen. But, fingers crossed, I can get them finished for the 16th of April. Uh, so there is something happening on, on the 16th of April. I'm not going to go into too, too much detail um, because it's not for me to say at the moment. I might be able to say it in the next few days, but we'll, you probably can figure it out, but we'll see. Um, <clears throat> I just want to say thank you to uh, for, every, for everyone's comments on my video as well. Um, and me not being around and, and stuff and trying to get this computer fixed and I was trying to do it this morning so y you're probably not really interested but because I've put a blank drive in I had to have windows on a USB and I had to boot the computer from that USB and I left, I did what I needed to do, but left the USB in and it just kept repeating the same thing over and over again. I rang my dad and I said, there's something wrong, it's not working. He said, did you remove the USB? And I went, no. And he went, well, that's why, because it's booting from that all the time. You need to remove that it, and then it, it will look for it, but it won't be there and it will boot from where it needs to. And I was like, oh, <laughs> oh I, I can use a computer. I, I'm, I'm pretty good with computers. Unless it's things like that. I'm just, yeah, no, not not for me. Um, right, I'm going to go for now. I don't think I'll be back again today unless there's anything else to say or whatever. Hopefully you will get to see this video because I'm recording on my camera. Um, I can use my camera. I have got a little device that I can put the memory stick into my phone. But my phone won't let me clip everything together properly. Oh, I don't. I don't know. Um, there is a free software called LumaFusion um, that you can get on Apple and Android, I think. It's free. It's a really, really good editing software. That's what my dad uses. Um, but it's very, it's a lot more, it's not just basic. There's a lot more to it as well. I have used it in the past, um, but it's just very more, like, I just want basic put these clips together if I want to transition if I want some music if I want I don't know some words <laughs> I want I want it I want it just to be spelled out in front of me what I need to do <laughs> um anyway right I'm gonna go and uh, I shall see you in the next clip I don't know when what who where when that will be <laughs> um but I'm just gonna sit and chill for a bit and uh, wait for Ian to get home I think he's gone to the garage actually so he probably won't be home till a little bit later 
that's fine because I can just sit here and chill because he's been here all week for the last two weeks um, so it's nice just to get some time to sit and chill and not that it's not that I, I can't watch what I want or do what I want it's you know what I don't know if anyone else gets that it's just nice to have a little bit of time where you can I don't know put around and where Ian will go, what are you doing now? What's, what are you doing? What's that? And I'm um, like, I just like just to, to potter. Anyway, right, yeah, I'm gonna sit, knit, drink my water. Might actually make a cup of tea because I've drunk quite a lot of of water already. Yeah, let's do that. Um, shall I quickly show you my plants? I know I'm just going in to onto a tangent now, but let me show you the plants. You'll have to excuse the sunshine. And these socks here are clean, <laughs> they're new. Uh, so here we have courgettes and I've had to put sticks in. They're really, they're, they're getting really big so I think they're gonna be ready for pots soon. Um, on this row here, we have sweet peppers, so like bell peppers. Here we have cucumber and I think I'm gonna have to put some um, sticks in for these as well soon. Um, here we've got sweet corn. So there, that one's massive, that one. Uh, we've got hot peppers here, so these are going to be um, like the long peppers. We've got spring onions here. And then here is the strawberries that Ian's sister um, gave to me yesterday. We've got vine tomatoes in this little row here. We've got spinach, which we've got two at the back there but nothing in the front here, so I might put some more seeds in to see. Oh, there's one there, look, this one's fallen over. I've watered them, so maybe that's why. Uh, then we've got garlic chives, and then here is sunflowers. Um, I just fancied putting some sunflowers in, and as you can see, I've used yarn. This one keeps falling over. I've used yarn just to attach them to the poles. And let me show you my desk, as it's tidy at the moment. Uh, tidy-ish so I have put this light this light was on the windowsill but you couldn't even see it so I've decided to put that there I've moved all of my jars around pots because um, my wood drawers was there so I've moved all that around obviously the laser will have to stay there um, it's just the best place for it the laptop um, and then I've just got my blocking pins here and my little yarn thing that I haven't used yet um, and then my spinner that I haven't used for ages and then my candle wax melts and then down here are my candles and wax melts I do want a different sort of thing for this I don't know what yet but it's it's doing the job at the moment but I do think I want a better storage solution because it's yeah um, here is my hard drive that I need to put back uh, with the screws. Yes, they're still there. <laughs> um, so yeah, I just thought that I just thought it looked quite nice and and not as messy. It was really messy before. It was really getting on my nerves. Um, so yeah, that's a lot tidier and everything's in the drawers now. Um, but yeah, it's nice and sunny at the moment. The cloud, there's lots of blue sky and clouds out there. So. Um, Right, I'm definitely going now because uh, I'm going to sit, I'm going to go and put the kettle on actually. Sit, knit, oh hello, I'm watching Craft House Magic, her East Anglia Yarn Festival vlog. <laughs> um, I just had a playlist and I, they were just playing one after the other. Right, I'm definitely going. I need to sort out this as well. Oh god, but I'm just going to sit down and chill for a bit. I will see you soon. Well... It's Monday, I've had my hair done, um, I feel so much better. It feels really, really bright at the moment. Um, it probably looks really bright, but um, yeah, I'm pleased that it's done. And I have, I've had like a little side fringe put in as well. Um, it's probably gonna drive me bonkers, but I just wanted something to, to frame my face a little bit. Like I had no layers at the front at all. Um, and I've just had it layered a little bit sort of down the front which is nice um yeah it's probably gonna drive me mad <laughs> uh but it is now 10 to 6 um ian's at the garage um again 
I think he's helping Bills do something, uh, like tidy up. I think they're tidying up, but I think they're also doing other bits and pieces as well. Uh, so, yeah, that's uh, that. I've only really just got home. I left here really early this morning because uh, I needed to go to the... Um, the, the hair shop <laughs> uh, to get my hair colour. I was going to go lighter and I was toying with the idea of going purple um, but I just thought to myself hmm purple's not really me, pink is me. Like this pink, light pink and stuff. So I just thought no I'm just going to stick with my pink and um, I had to, I only had a tiny little bit left of the one that I had um, so I went and bought another one and a tub of conditioner to to mix it in and um, I think it's come out pretty nice. Um, this colour is Cerise uh, by Directions and I get um, get that and I just mix a bit of conditioner in with it um, just to, it, it makes it a little bit lighter but it also makes it easier to um, sort of come out as well. It makes it, and it makes it more like um, a hair conditioning treatment even though the colour that I buy is basically conditioner with pigment in it uh, but um, putting extra conditioner in it's like a having like a little hair treatment thing um, and after obviously bleaching it feels really really nice um, I've just made myself a coffee which is really nice um, and I've been so yeah, I left really early this morning, had to go and get my um, hair colour, went to my friends, didn't leave there till about three, <laughs> um, and then I had to go to Iceland to pick up some food for dinner and some shopping, and then I popped to Tesco, um, they were like sort of, op they're, they're sort of opposite each other um, on the way home, so I went there, and then I'm now back here, I've put the shopping away. Uh, realised that I bought a box of Coke, so we drink Coke Zero, um, and I normally just buy the box of 24, it's just easier, and uh, thought this morning, I think this, last night, oh, Ian wanted a drink, um, and I was in the kitchen, so I got him a drink, it was the last can in the drink, in the fridge, uh, so I thought, oh, while I'm out tomorrow, I'll get some more, and um, I've gone and bought another box, come into the kitchen, turn around, realise there's half a box on the floor. <laughs> Never mind, it, it really it's gonna get it's gonna get drunk at some point, it don't matter. Um we normally have like um a cold drink with our dinner. So um yeah. Um I'm gonna try and edit this vlog. Uh it's a bit of a nothing vlog, just it's a tester really, see how we get on. Um I'm gonna eat some of this which is a protein yogurt because I haven't had any lunch today. Um, I know, really bad. And we're going to have a chicken carbonara for dinner. Um, just a Slim and World one. I said to Ian it would be nice just to get some like, easy meals to put in the oven. And I got, I think I've got, um, a, no, I don't think, I have got um, a tikka masala for Ian and a Rogan Josh for me for tomorrow. Uh, because I'm going to my sister's tomorrow to babysit for um, an hour or so while... My sister does something on the computer or upstairs, um, but she can't really do it with the kids around, so I said I'll um, go and watch the boys, which will be lovely. They're playing Lego at the moment, I've just spoken to her. They're playing Lego, <laughs> um, and yeah, I think, I think they're making a mess, but it's they're enjoying themselves. That's all, that is all that matters, they're enjoying themselves. Um, but I will hopefully get back to daily vlogging tomorrow um i'm gonna probably end this vlog at this clip and then back tomorrow as normal i did finish a sock so i can't remember if i showed you the sock or not but i did finish a sock and i have cast on for the second one and i have not worked on anything else at all um last night i played on my phone the whole evening <laughs> Um, and then I think even the day before I played on my phone and I think because I got such a big project off the needles my flax I just wanted something but like I worked on my, my socks for a bit and then I didn't really do much else um, so Saturday night 
we went out for food and then we got back and I was, oh my God, I was so full up. It was unbelievable that, yeah, I didn't even knit. I just played on my phone. <laughs> and then, um, last night, I think I did a little bit of knitting. I can't remember, to be honest. Um, but yeah, so Ian's back on days this week and a bit of... I say normality, but really normality should now be days and nights. <laughs> um, but you get used to one thing, and I, I, for for guys that do men and women um, that do shift work, then it it must be so tough because what well, I'm finding it tough, and it's Ian going to work. <laughs> um, but your routine gets all knocked out of out of place and. Um, it's nice because obviously I can work from home and I do what I do, um, but if I was working during the day and stuff out of the house, I, it, I, I'm assuming it would be, it would be more difficult, um, because obviously I won't get to see Ian as much, I'd be going to bed early, um, he'd be going to work and stuff, so... But yeah, I can stay up late, and even though I stay up late, I can stay up really, really late, and I still wake up at the same time every day. Um, but I did set my alarm this morning, and I felt really good for waking up a bit earlier. So I might do that tomorrow and see how we get on for the rest of the week. Um, because then next week, obviously Ian will be on nights. And I just find that when Ian's on nights, I go to bed a lot, uh, a lot later. Um... So yeah, I'm just really rambling now, aren't I? I'm so sorry. Um, yeah, so tomorrow I've got my Zoom in the morning. I didn't open it last week, so I'm going to definitely open it tomorrow. Um, I said to my sister that I'll be there for um, when she's... like I'll, I'll go with her to pick the boys up from school. And uh, yeah, so I'll open that for a couple of hours. I'm going to get this video up... Um, probably today if I can get it edited and uploaded um, because there's not been one for a little while so um, but thank you again for all your lovely comments um, it does it means a lot thank you right I'm gonna drink this have a bit of my uh, protein yogurt and then wait for Ian to let me know when he's on his way home so I can put some dinner on and just chill um, I am shattered I really am I haven't really done anything but I just think being out of the house <laughs> has, uh, has just knackered me out. So, but yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you've all enjoyed. I hope you all have a lovely week. Um, obviously, I'll see you throughout, throughout the week, hopefully, fingers crossed. Um, but I hope that you will come and watch me for the rest of my videos. And I shall see you, hopefully, tomorrow. Bye, guys.